Hello Kingsway family. I am remembering six months ago where I came to you all without warning, pretty much unprepared to tell you about our plans in response to COVID-19. We were announcing on March the 12th that we were suspending worship that Sunday. We had no idea what was to come in the days that followed. We have worked very hard as a staff and as a church community and our leadership to make the most of these six months as we have been separated in person. And as we have provided so many different things, I want to lift up one of them that was especially important to me and my pastor's heart. We had two drive up communions, one in July and one in August. And in those moments, it was hot with the mask on and I felt a little bit sweaty, but there was a lot of emotion behind my mask and my glasses on those days as it was good to connect with one another. And we know as a church, we are brought together as the body of Christ. And that means people coming together. Now, we've also learned in the six months, there's different ways that we can come together. We have celebrated that well and what a gift that has been. And now we move to a time of offering in-person worship for those that are able to come. We look forward to those that are able to be with us this week and for those that are not yet, we will still continue to provide the online presence. And in order for our worship to go smoothly this coming Sunday and in future Sundays, we will need volunteers um, to help us in the many responsibilities that it takes for hospitality, parking, and greeting. So I invite you to reach out to Kay Barty, Catherine, Kay Barty at kwumc.com if you can help in any way. I pray for you as I ask you to pray for myself and our staff and our leadership as we prepare for the days to come. One thing that I have learned in 2020 is that all of our next plans may not go exactly the way that we expect, but we can go with them together and with God. I look forward to what comes next with each of you.